Why, hello, Why, hello everybody. everybody. Welcome hello. to the first, the first ever episode of Team Spoon Spoon of Spoonularity, of Spoonularity please. Nickelodeon, Nickelodeon. SpongeBob, SpongeBob SquarePants, Battle, Battle for Bikini Bottom, Bottom. Rehydrated. Rehydrated. I'm Alex, I'm Alex but, not but not the not Paper, Paper Mario, Mario expert. Mario. I'm Heather. Now let's get I'll fucking get started, started on reliving our fucking childhoods. <laughs> Welcome to Bikini Bottom, a normally peaceful undersea sanctuary. Today it will be transformed into a theater of pure horror, wherein our little yellow friend will play the starring role. Today is the big day. I have devised an ingenious plan to fight. <laughs> With my brand new Duplicato Tron 3000, I'll clone an army at my command! One last review of the checklist. Let's see. Item number one is Plankton a genius. Answer yes! Okay, checklist complete. Throw in the switch! <laughs> Welcome, my perfectly obedient robot army. Hang on, I want to get a photo for my scrap. Whoop. Hey, hello? What do you think you're doing? Oh, no, 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 wait, wait! But I'm your master! I made you! No, no! Oh, my good China! Another perfect day playing robots and racehorses. Yeah, only I keep getting the racehorses and the robots mixed up. Wouldn't it be great if we had real robots to play with, Patrick? I'd name mine Robo Jr. or Zorlon or maybe Frankie. Yeah, these unreal robots are getting boring. Hey, what if we put the robots in here? Oh, how shellfish of you. I, 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 it's not just any shell, it's my magic wishing shell. Wow, that's great, Patrick. So we put the toy robots in here. Okay. And we say the magic wishing words and shake the magic wishing shell. Okay. Then we go to sleep, and in the morning, we'll have real robots to play with. But Patrick, Aren't we going to say the magic wishing words? You already did! So, okay is the magic wishing word? It used to be Alakazama Alabala Wiesna Tikitana Fushbar Griddle Bits Von Wiedeschnauzer, but I kept forgetting it. Are you sure this will work? Sure! Last week I only had one big cookie crumb and I was really hungry. So I put my cookie crumb in the magic wishing shell, then I said the magic wishing word and shook it, and in the morning I had lots of little cookie crumbs. Patrick, I proclaim that tomorrow is going to be the best day ever. Good night, SpongeBob. Good night, Patrick. The next morning. <laughs> Gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with... Whoa! Uh, Gary, did you do that? Meow. Yeah, Gary, it sure looks like we're in a doozy of a pickle. I think I'm gonna have to learn a lot in order to fix this mess. Meow. What a fantastic idea! These signs will provide important tips to help me out. Um, how do I read the signs? Ow. Oh, okay. Press this button to read the signs. Hmm. Ow. So if I want to come back and talk to you again, just walk up to you and press this button. I'd better get started now, Gary. I think that this is going to be a very long day. I don't remember. Is all the dialogue read out loud in this game? It probably wasn't in the old one. Oh, it's been so long. I remember there was, like, stuff like that. I just remember all the dialogue was read out loud. I'm just gonna move this thing over. 
Okay, we lost a couple seconds of uh, audio in that cutscene because I was I had it playing out my head and I forgot. Oh, it's okay. Oh, oh that's okay. The rainbow now. Oh, this is a fucking throwback. It really is, like the music and everything. I don't remember what the currency is called. There's a tiny thing. I believe these are clouds. I don't think they're clouds. Okay. Too pretty! Can't take it! They're just called shiny objects. <laughs> fucking episode of Spongebob where he gets stuck in this thing? No, I don't. It's uncomfortable. Is it one of the older episodes or a newer one? The newer one. I haven't seen anything ah. They have a fucking picture of him and... I think that's an extra life. like the implications of the health being underwear because it just means he like pisses himself when he gets scared. Why would you <laughs> assume he pisses himself instead well, of ripping his pants? Well, I mean, I guess. But if he ripped his pants, then he wouldn't necessarily need new underwear. He'd need new pants. I think it's more like he pissed himself because he just took damage and he got... Okay. 
You want to suck a nose to have here? No, oh, I'm good. Thanks for the offer, though. I'm so glad he has a free picture. <laughs> Nothing like the sounds of your own neighborhood. Go away, SpongeBob. You're polluting my thinking space. Trying to steal the Krabby Patty formula again, eh, Plankton? Well, you won't get away with it. I've got bigger fish to fry. I've got to figure out how to regain control of the chum bucket from those robots. Where did they come from? Where? Make them do um, I don't know. Game. Not for me, though, that's for sure. They just showed up out of nowhere and started calling me rude names and throwing things. <laughs> they even bent all my spoons. I love those spoons like they were my children. The spoons. The spoons. That's terrible. I, I wasn't going to help them before. Oh, won't but you help spoons. me stop them? We gotta do before it. they bent all my forks. We don't Not care the about your forks. Of course I'll help. But wait, I'm supposed to collect a whole lot of golden spatulas. Golden spatulas, eh? SpongeBob, if you could get me back into the chum bucket, I'll give you a bucket full of golden spatulas. In your dreams. You've got a deal. I forgot how all these like. Those it shines! Uh, those guys are the hey, SpongeBob! Are tight, so if you go up to I just them, dropped by to give you a bubble hand! Bubble buddy! You see, you're going to need to learn some new bubble blowing moves if you're going to journey to the ninth dimension and defeat the giant monkey man! But, uh, all I need to do is figure out how to get rid of these robots. Oh, yeah, sorry. I've been in the soap bottle a little too long. Uh, where were we? Uh, something about new bubble moves? Right! Press this button and you'll launch yourself straight up in the air with bubble power that defeats anything that is direct... Well, I already learned this. Don't forget to defeat robots or... Oh, there was like a bowling power you get at this point. I, I, like, can't remember how you get rid of the guy, guys. Oh, yeah. SpongeBob, this flapping robot crisis is making the Krusty Krab lose money like a sinking ship. No money means no more Krusty Krab. No more Krusty Krab means no more fry cooking for you. Is that this does not boy? sound like the voice actor. <laughs> no more fry cooking? But because you're gullible, I'm going to help you out. And of course, make a small profit in return. I've got a few golden spatulas that I'll be willing to trade to you for some of those shiny objects. I really feel like they could have picked a better Your fake treasure the chest's bed. looking a bit light, boy. Do you think I've got bilge water on the brain? I ain't running a charity here. What the fuck? Ew. It just feels so wrong. The game is gonna tell you how to do that in 50 seconds. Well, I mean, like. How do you get up there? Can I just, like. Uh, I think I'm gonna see some. Yeah, I'm just. That just looks like regular underwear. Oh, maybe that's it. It's all coming together. Ah. Now I 
I can wear four pairs of underwear. This is great. Fresh like a spring breeze. I want to get comfortable with the controls first. I love opening presents. I the controller and I don't know how to do something. I want to make sure you know how to do it. Okay. Hey, Patrick. Nice sock. What sock? The one you're standing on. Oh, that one. It's lost. Well, if that one's lost, where are your other socks? Well, they're more lost. A bunch of robots came through here and stole my whole sock collection. I could use some help getting them back. Sure thing, Patrick. What are best friends for? Okay, then. For every ten socks you bring back to me, I'll give you a golden turkey baster. You mean spatula? Bless you. Another find for Patrick! Uh, I don't remember what the first area is. <laughs> you wanna... <laughs> do you wanna break this up into tiny episodes or do you wanna do it in like one two hour session? Um, we can break it up. How long do we have on this one? I don't know, don't finish it. Wanna call now? No, let's at least go to like the first area. I... What are you waiting for, Spud? Oh, we gotta go to the chum bug. Oh, you just did a chum bug. Come on, show what happened. Ah, the rolling green hills of jellyfish fields. A place to experience nature at its most raw, and sometimes a bit tender from the stings. Squidward, are you okay? No, I'm not okay, you barnacle head. Do I look like I'm okay? Well, Where your you nose does look pretty big. I mean, bigger than usual because it's usually pretty big. And you look clammy. And oh my gosh, you're bald! <laughs> I can't get over the fucking face. <laughs> I've always been bald, but now I'm stung all over. Well, according to the Jellyfisher Field Manual, severe jellyfish stings can be treated effectively by applying a thick layer of King Jellyfish Jelly to the affected areas. <laughs> King j j Jellyfish! Well, I guess you're off to scale Sport Mountain and die a horrible death under the vicious tentacles of King Jellyfish. <laughs> I'll stay here, balled up here in excruciating pain. You do that! Don't worry, Squidward! I'll bring back that King Jellyfish Jelly for you to rub all over yourself! I remember this. I remember the final boss. Wow. Oh, I'm not gonna say what it is. Do you remember? I wonder what it could be. <laughs> no, but like... I, like, I remember... This is goop. I love how they live underwater and they don't know how to swim. Uh, they can't swim. Oh yeah, that connects, like... That's a teleporter. You gotta open the other one, or it's not gonna do it. Jellyfish today, I'm going fishing for robots! 
I like how I told you how to do that, like, Feel like a new spot three times, but it didn't tell you about the boxes. Or the taxi. Fuck you, box. Like a spring breeze. I feel like it didn't look bad in the original. I feel like I need to see a side by side compare to really appreciate what You're not gonna go with that team? That's how you get it. Unless it's a different Yeah, there we go. 
You must have such a bad wedgie as you're doing that. No, it's okay. I'm gonna Like a good place to call it ever. Okay. Hi. Uh, so, we well, we started this game in this episode. In next episode, we'll keep playing this game. Keep on spooning. <laughs>